I've been doing research on Westington Plantation for about 32 years now, and I've been actively writing the book for about three years. When I first saw the photograph in my seventh grade history book, for some reason I kept being drawn to this picture, and it looked like I should know the people like they were relatives. And I later found out from my grandmother that they were actually her grandparents. So I became totally fascinated at that point with tracing our family history. Right now I'm standing in the exact spot that the photograph of my ancestors was taken at Westington in 1892. There were hundreds of people that lived here on the plantation. It was probably never quiet but that many people being here. I often wondered what they were thinking while they were here. I'm sure they were praying that they would one day be emancipated. One reason it is very important to document African American history because a lot relating to African American history is not recorded from the African American perspective. Most of what we have about African American history is written from the slave owner, but I've been able to get more of an accurate viewpoint from their side of the story. In 1860, Westington contained 13,000 acres in one farm. They also owned more than 2,000 acres in Tennessee and Kentucky. This was the largest tobacco plantation in America and the second largest in the world. A lot of African Americans uh, cannot document their family histories. One of the major things that I was able to do in my research, most of the information that I got as far as oral histories could be documented in the Washington family papers. The Washington family deposited all their records in the Tennessee State Library and Archives. It is extremely rare to have photographs of African Americans from such an early period. We have some photographs from as early as 1849, many of them in the late 1880s, 90s, and early 1900s. I think it would be very important for young African Americans and young people in general to read the book because a lot of uh, people do not realize what all the slaves went through, especially young African Americans. A lot of things they take for granted and they have no idea how our ancestors had to live. I feel somehow that uh, it was meant for me to find all this information. My, uh, one of my great aunts always told me that it was meant for me to do this research and uh, she said that my ancestors found me instead of me finding them.